the bible has some very very harsh words and harsh things that we struggle to understand today i want to read to you from psalm 109 when you read it you see that david is telling god to intervene against the wrongful accusers over his life he goes to the extent of asking god to even punish them and kill them off but you must understand this is a genuine dialogue between a father and a son a man who loves god and walked with god and the same with you you can say what you want to say to god but you must understand in the message what david is really really saying and pleading with god so let me read three sets of passages so that it makes a little bit more sense to you the first one is from verses 1 and 2 my god who my praise do not remain silent for the people who are wicked and deceitful have opened their mouth against me they have spoken against me with lying tongues so david is saying these guys are accusing me wrongfully uh, so this is a petition you can make now for the balance i need to put a pair of glasses so that you see what i see a little bit more bold magnified okay so uh, verse 4 in return for my friendship they accuse me but i am a man of prayer hey when people are accusing you what do you do are you a man a woman of prayer pleading to god to help you and verse 31 at the end of it he says for he that's the lord uh, stands at the right hand of the needy to save their lives from those who would condemn them friends when you read the bible put on your glasses look deeper let the revelation hit you it's not about putting another man down but telling god your heart telling god you're struggling but more important be in prayer and tell god god stand with me stand for me because i have not done anything wrong and i know because i trust in you you stand with me and i will be cleared of all my wrong doings have a great day walk in faith walk boldly people hit the trees which have fruit and if you are being accused that is because you have fruit don't worry about it move boldly because the lord almighty is with you loving you and standing with you God bless you.